Hey guys, my name is Jeff, and today we're going to be looking at a very rare Mustang. This is the Iacocca Silver 45th Anniversary Edition Ford Mustang, and it's so rare that they only built 45, with this car being specifically number 33. Now, all of the cars were actually sold through Galpin Ford with a starting price of $89,950. Now, in case you're not familiar with Iacocca or Lee Iacocca, he is considered the father of the Mustang, hence the name, and he actually held a variety of different titles at Ford, including president of Ford Motor Company. Along with a variety of other achievements, he's also the one who convinced Henry Ford II to go racing at Le Mans. So, for GT, you can thank Iacocca for that. So, he would later work to save the drowning Chrysler Corporation, along with a ton of other achievements. That's not giving enough glory to everything that he did as a uh, individual in the auto industry. But, let's get back to the car. So you'll notice that there's some exterior changes in this car, um, the main being that this car was actually created and designed by Michael Leone and built by Gafliglio Family Metal Crafters out of California, a coach building company in collaboration with Lee Iacocca. So it technically wasn't an internal job, but mostly limited to uh, cosmetic modifications on the exterior, but there were some performance additions as well. Now, despite being modified outside of Ford, the cars would still be sold with a Ford racing package warranty, which I think is a pretty cool thing. It's not like they're touching... Um, the sort of major components, but anywho, back to it. Now, all of these cars were actually finished in silver over a black interior and those massive 20-inch chrome alloy wheels. You can see there, there's even the eye and the eye of Coca badging on the rear, and you can see how the actual fastback part runs pretty much all the way to the end of the car, which is a pretty different change from the standard S197 generation Mustang, and even the side uh, vents there are a little bit more low-key for the rear quarter windows. But anywho, all these cars were finished in silver with black. You can see there's even a plaque in the middle there that actually says it was built um, by Michael Leone, the uh, Family Metal Crafters, and of course in collaboration with Lee Iacocca. And then at the bottom, it tells you which car it is. So on top of that, for power options, you're looking at an optional supercharged 4.6 liter V8, making 400 horsepower. That's what's in this car, although there was a standard option for the standard Mustang GT, naturally aspirated 4.6 liter V8, which was rated for 320 horsepower. Now, all cars were equipped with the Tremec TR3650 five-speed manual transmission, which I think is great. If you're going to limit the Mustang to just 45 units, might as well just make them all manuals, right? The cars also received the upgraded Ford Racing Handling Package, which essentially came with firmer springs, modified shock absorbers, and 14-inch disc brakes, which are about a 2-inch increase over the standard GT brakes. Now, if you're wondering what current values are, I mentioned that the car was new for about $89,950. The current market still finds the cars trading hands between about eighty dollars and $90,000. So I think that's pretty cool. These cars have held their value pretty well. Whether you like the aesthetics or not is ultimately up to you. The elongated fastback makes a totally different look for the car, but let me know what you think down below so with that that's going to be the end of the video but if you did enjoy it could hit that like button for me i'd really appreciate it and consider getting subscribed for more content like this in the future and if you've ever seen one of these before i'm curious to see how many people are actually even heard of this mustang let me know down below and of course thank you so much for watching